Hello, welcome to Tech Diet. Let's dive into our today's problem maximum odd binary number. It says you are given a binary string S that contains at least one one. You have to rearrange the bits in such a way that the resulting binary number is the maximum odd binary number that can be created from this combination. Let's see this example. We have 0, 1, 0. We need to find an odd number which is the largest out of the given sequence once we rearrange this once. So one thing to keep in mind a number to be an odd number, the LSP of that bit should be one so the very first bit should be one and because that's what make it odd uh, the bits like two four eight these all will be making the number as even so if you want to be a not this has to be set as one so since we have just one single one the answer would be like this one itself and if you look at the another test case so here our last bit is already set we can call it first bit or last bit and to make it the largest number we need to find the msp because that's where the most weight is so we can shift it here and then we'll end it up in the corresponding number if it would have been this triple one so we'll add this one here we'll add this one here so we'll fill the msbs before uh, filling the lsps so that's what we'll take our approach we'll count the number of ones there we'll fill the msbs we'll add a mandatory one at the last so let's do that let's uh, find the corresponding character array of the given bind uh, string sequence so we'll iterate over this character array we'll say if this character is a one i need to make a counter of that so this will be like count plus plus once i have found okay then it should be we should make the last character no matter what it should be one always so that i can make it a mandatory odd number then i can decrement my count of ones because i've just used one here then for the remaining number of ones which is let's say i'll fill the msps so let's start with filling msps int i will be zero there i plus plus for each iteration once this is done i'll fill my character array with the remaining options which is fill it with zero so once this is done i can safely return character the string equivalent of this character array let's try to use the example test cases so we have yep let's try to hit submit let's accept it works thank you